black hoodie, I'm back cooking these goodies. Look at these views from cooking these foods. Yeah. Well, well, well. What up, world? Back with another one today. As you can see from the title, we got the hut. We got nothing but the Pizza Hut. And it is looking on another level of delicious. And uh, I am just so incredibly in the mood for it. Uh, I, even though I had a pizzone like a week ago, it just didn't really do what I needed it to do in terms of my crave for the hut. And this is everything I need. So some chicken bites, a perfectly cooked double cheese pepperoni pizza, and if you're gonna have a Pizza Hut, you must, it's a requirement, quintessential, crucial, a nice ice cold Coke. Full sugar, no diet, has to happen, full sugar, because if you're having this meal, it's like, you might as well just have the whole thing. I mean, go for the gusto. I brought some buffalo sauce down as well, for whatever reason, I don't know. Uh, but you know we may we may use it and today we're just going straight mukbang style I got nothing pre-planned and I just want to really really enjoy this and just chop it up with you on just some basic stream of consciousness human type stuff so all right unless I do it this guy back here is looking great so we might as well just go in with that it's you know Pizza Hut is just it's Pizza Hut. You can't. It's like McDonald's. It's like it's its own amazing thing. Wow, that's doing it for me. Right for you. Rest is for me. Ken Domic food reviews. And if you watch Ken Domic. I used to watch them hard. That's actually a little bit how I got into this whole realm of YouTube was through food, food, food reviews. I used to watch so many food reviewers. Joey's World Tour. Any of you guys watch Joey's World Tour? His comment section is out of control. He's a bit of a meme, but I actually like don't mind the guy. Like I hate certain aspects of like sometimes in his like just when he's too loud, but for the most part, he actually seems like not a bad dude. All right, let's try one of these chicken bites. Yeah, whatever. Let's just keep it messy. Who cares at this point? So that's honey barbecue. Straight up. Try it with some ranch. So good with the ranch. Yo, so actually, I've been meaning to say this, and I'm not trying to bring haterade, because I'm mostly positive about everything, and, you know, I'm just pretty much a positive person, but this is me trying to help you out, and I just, I don't get it. Maybe some people in their audience find it, like, funny and, like, intriguing. But, like, I just, for some reason, I can't stand it, especially when they've edited other parts of their video. So it's like, I know they have an editing program. When mukbangers and, or whoever, like, people eating, eating or whatever, they, they do, like, the whole, like, the, oh, this could be the thumbnail. And then they do, like, the stupid, like, and they don't edit it out. <laughs> just edit it out. But maybe your audience likes that. So maybe that's a point of your video that specifically your audience likes. I don't know. 
it's just so awkward to me watching the like cringy like freeze frame thumbnail moment does anybody else agree it's just especially weird to me when they they add like intros and they have outros like they edit like it's clear that they edit I just don't know understand like what, just snip that part out too maybe no anyways don't like being a hater so let's not do that wow this meal is on point check that that's nice the reason why I actually needed this so bad was I was watching fart and fresh he just uploaded like a, a pepperoni pizza, a Pizza Hut video with, with wings and stuff. And I just, his pizza looks so good. And I had just been thinking about it for hours and hours and hours and hours. And I was just like, I got to pull the trigger. He, however, did something that threw me way off. It was dip a... Uh, a Krispy Kreme donut in ranch. I was so thrown off by that move. I just can't be, see like a sweet thing being good in ranch. Really doesn't make sense to me, but hey, maybe. Maybe that's a vibe. Okay, let's do a little chicken pizza. That's good. But how is this? Is this good? ultimate bite delicious definitely one of my favorite things about the hut was that crispy pan fried edge on that dough so key Two things, now that I have room here it's for a little bit of a sauce area for the buffalo, we will try that. And secondly, I just realized I totally forgot to even mention my whole new like background setup. It's like more like a chill dude vibes. Not completely blacked out, it has like a good, nice chill energy. I think it's gonna lend well to the videos. I'm super into it. <clears throat> I also slightly feel like a like a hot ASMR girl, like one of those popular ones, like GB and that, that have like the, like the like the backlighting and the nice like low lit with the front and everything. Like I'm very becoming a GB, you know? So. I just feel very official. Buffalo sauce, very, very good. Gotta do the mix up though. That's where it's at. But yeah, I got my my foam, my sound treatment. The 
got some more equipment coming from Amazon for music production. Got the two times spicy noodles coming. I grabbed that uh, that game with the jelly bellies called Bean Boozled. It's like disgusting flavor roulette. So I'm very excited and intrigued to see how that's gonna go. And another surprise in that video with the bean boozled, I might have a special guest. You will see who upon the day of the dropping of the video. These lights are sick too. I can like make them dance and like change colors. I can just select like do I want red? What's up red? I want some green? I personally like these like pink ones. Kind of pinky purple. Got the clear too, just like the regular, but pinky purple is where it's at for me. Cause I'm a softy. I just think it accent accents the vibe a little better. <clears throat> All right, I'm getting to the point where I'm starting to feel full, but we must have a spicy sweet buffalo chicken. Mm, yeah, that's good. Okay, where am I at? Yeah, I could do one more chicken for sure. Maybe one more piece. One more chicken and one more piece, maybe. A ranch. Mmm. So good. Pizza Hut is on their game today. I would have to say. Okay, maybe one more. It's gonna be tough. I am going to regret it, but we will do it. In the name of internet eating gluttony. I've already come this far with this channel. Can't back down now. You know what I mean? The internet is forever. And uh, I've subjected myself to that, so yeah, it is what it is. It's actually the funnest shit, though. Like, I love doing this. I don't, like, it's so, it's like, I don't know. I, I, people, like, some people just get mad at it, and, like, I don't know. It's just, like, having fun. <laughs> Other people like to like they just enjoy it. They relax and just like have like fun entertainment. Like I have fun doing it, so it's like I don't know. <laughs> so I understand why some people just waste their energy getting mad at things in the world like that. It's like just don't and don't watch it or <laughs> don't waste moments of your life watching things that you just that you don't like. I don't get why you'd ever do that to yourself. Do you like torturing yourself? I guess so. And if that's the case for you here, enjoy your torture for however more long you watch this video. <laughs> That's just weird.
All right. I'm definitely at the point. I cannot. No, this is. I can't even talk. I can't push forward any further. So good though. But yeah, super excited for these uh, these new videos coming up soon. Almost at the 50k mark too. What a milestone! It's taken so long it seems. Um, but just a big shout out and thank you to all you new subscribers because there's been quite a bit lately, and uh, obviously the OGs and everybody who's been with me along the way. Super uh, grateful for it to be honest. Uh, to get to 50k though it's like i want to hit that 100 at some point but that's another 50 away it's like it took me this long to get here it's like <laughs> it's a long road ahead but i got nothing better to do <laughs> so you know what it is till the next one eat good live well stay true peace